Hello, welcome to Review. Okay, so I'm gonna get started with you guys. There it goes. Um, for today's readings, I was gonna do the readings outside, but it was super windy. If you do not believe me, go watch that cancer sign reading because it was so windy. I was like, no, I gotta go now. <laughs> but I'm gonna use the energy oracle and then I'm gonna use the chakra person oracle cards today. So let's get into it. Let's see what messages God has for you guys. We have action and we have the third chakra, which is your third chakra. So I'm hearing maybe taking action, communicating something, expressing yourself in some type of way. Um, something that needs to be said. You'll know what that is. For some of you guys, this is about love, a love connection. So maybe something that you need to say to a loved one or someone that you love, someone that you're in a relationship with. Or even some of you guys, someone that you admire or want to be with. Look at that. Someone that you might want to be with with that caring connection. So this is definitely about a relationship. Okay. But let's see. Let me, I see the healer of the ages. Okay. And connection there. So maybe you're trying to work on your relationship. Heal that connection that you have with someone. Something like that. Got a message for right now. Let's come back to you. The woman holding her heart here. So yeah, this is definitely a love connection. I feel like this could be you or someone else, you know. But at the end of the day, I feel like this is a love connection. There's something here that I'm hearing needs to be worked on, needs to be expressed when it comes to your love life. Maybe you need to tell someone how you truly feel, express your emotions a little bit more. Um, with those of you guys who are very logical, because <laughs> you know sometimes people are like Virgos can be very logical, right? Or or not even that, just very realistic. Whatever it is, I feel like I'm hearing you need to let go, let loose, not be so stubborn if you've been stubborn in a love relationship. And just express yourself, express your truth to this person. I feel like they'll understand I'm hearing, they'll understand. Wow, look at this. We have the fifth chakra here. And let me see, I'm gonna check my chakra Bible. For the fifth chakra, isn't that so like this? I'd be forgetting, so don't judge me. Oh, that is so precious. Okay, I'm getting better. It's okay. <laughs> um, key issues here power, fear, anxiety, and introversion. So, I'm hearing maybe some of you guys have become too introspective, been too in your head, been too to yourself, isolating yourself. I'm hearing as well. Um, maybe out of some type of fear, a period of judgment or rejection, maybe for some of you guys, if you're not in a love condition. <coughs> oh, excuse me. I'm gonna drink real quick. The next card out we have is envy here. So maybe someone is jealous of you. I'm here, this could be a friend, friend of me, something like that. Maybe someone is jealous of you. If you have not watched that sneaks, um, watch out for sneaks, fakes video that I did yesterday. Yeah, yesterday. Yesterday. Okay, it talks all about that. So if this energy is speaking to you, go watch that. We're not gonna spend time on them today. Things. But we have the angel of balance. Balance out your life with your logic, your emotions. That's what you need to balance out in this in this time, okay? Next one, we have the door to romance. Yeah, some of you guys really need to open up here because this door is opening wide open. So you see the, the heart's kind of blocked up. Let your heart out. Speak your truth. 333 on the clock. That's about positivity, creativity, good luck. You know, I'm hearing passion for some of you guys going after passion in the beginnings. Oh my gosh, who's behind that? The angel of love. Shut up. Yeah, this is some type of love connection here. I mean, this you need to open up to be open and receptive to. And then look at that. This door to value underneath that as well that's opening up for you guys. So, hey, that's, that's looking good. Your money's looking right. You're looking right, I'm hearing. I'm hearing you getting all the girls. You getting all the guys. <laughs> okay, I'm hearing this secret admirers. There's some people that like you. When it comes to your money, though, some of you guys are indecisive about, I'm hearing your career opportunity, which career is based, I mean, not based, but best for you. Some of you guys is also a home base that you're looking for. Others of you, I'm hearing maybe a hybrid job that you're looking for to go in the office sometimes. Maybe not, who knows? You can get how it resonates. Thank you, God, for those messages that have come through this far. Let's get into this next deck and see what other messages come up for you guys. I see gratitude and expansion, okay? Um, I'm hearing, have a great heart, pray, um, you know, be mindful of that um, in this day, in this age. Thank God for all that you have. So with that gratefulness, I feel like that's also going to help you to expand on here. 
I'm hearing that's going to bring in that door to value because I'm seeing the door to value card. I'm also seeing um, that love card, door to romance popping up. The angel of love popped up in my head. Okay. Maybe I'm four of wands. I feel like this is taking some type of truth, right? I just need that abundance too. So yeah, that's going to help you bring in more abundance, more blessings, the more grateful and thankful that you are. Okay. Any other cards for them? read this one first. Bam. Look at that trickery. That's that envious, nasty energy again. Somebody's trying to trick you. Okay? Or this is you tricking yourself out of a good opportunity because of fear and anxiety. Take it how it resonates. Alright, so underneath, well, let's get started. We have recovery. So you guys are recovering from heartbreak. I'm hearing from something of the past that you're healing. You're working through that. You're going to move past that and you're going to be good. Golden. 555. Five, change in past here there's some type of blockage whatever it is that you need to work on i'm hearing triggered you're being triggered to work on something so whatever that is for you each person is going to be different um some of you guys are not being triggered right now so you know if it's not for you it's not for you but at the end of the day with this impasse this is some type of block that is blocking your path blocking your way or this is somebody external to you i'm hearing external to you for some of you guys there's someone trying to block you Okay? Maybe from negativity. But it's sweet because this is someone that you gotta cut off. Maybe this again, that's a friend of me. Someone that you're you're noticing is like, why do you always negative? They seem happy when you're kinda down. They wanna be there to get all the juicy gossip of here, juicy gossip. They wanna be only your business <laughs> when it ain't going right. Hmm. Okay, some of them I'm hearing handouts. So some people are also trying to get handouts. Okay, behind that, I'd say peeking through that isolation. Did I not say some of y'all are taking a lot of time to yourself or needing to take time to yourself? Isolating yourself here. Yeah, look at that service. Some of you guys are definitely getting into a new job or wanting to get into this new career where you're helping people. I'm hearing there's many opportunities out here. Um, before you get started with a job, though, some of you guys could also volunteer. Read the top. So with these two coming out together, I feel like this is definitely you working on yourself. This is you healing yourself, your self-image, how you feel about yourself as well. Really growing, okay? I'm working on you. Wow, look at that. Underneath self-worth, okay? Can't make it up. It makes so much sense to me. I hope it makes sense to you. Yeah, this is all part of your destiny. This is all part of what you need to do. I'm also hearing balance out. Whenever I see black and white like that, I always think yin-yang, okay? Yeah. So maybe it's also need to go after what it is that you're passionate about. Okay, guys. So that is your quick little read. All right. I hope you all enjoyed this message. Thank you guys for being here with me.